In problem six, uh, you're told that these lines M and N are parallel to each other and you want to solve for X. Okay, so um, the strategy for solving this kind of problem that I would recommend is to imagine drawing your own line that's also parallel to the given parallel lines right through the vertex created in that angle. So really X is going to be made up of two measures or two angles, this angle here and this angle here. So what we can do is use the properties of uh, the transversal of parallel lines. If we think of this as the transversal, this angle of 77 and its alternate interior angle will be equal. So we know that the lower part of the whole angle X is going to be 77 degrees. And now if we use line M and this green line that we drew in as our parallel lines and then this as our transversal we once again have alternate interior angles that are equal to each other so that meets this upper part of angle X 15 degrees so X together is going to be 15 plus 77 and that gives us our total answer of 92 degrees